as most of you who use uh, creo sketch and uh, creo you know that we can create uh, alphabets and uh, write something uh, in the sketch here let me show you here we have created a sketch and this text we can define the length or the height of our text and then we can write here a b c d as we want and uh, we have some predefined creo fonts here font 3d that is always what shows uh, when you write the text but you have others uh, inside cg times etc but uh, you don't have any option uh, if uh, a question arises in your mind that you want to use some of the windows font that you use um, inside like microsoft word or uh, uh, like uh, you want to use some font from internet like this let's say we want to use this fantastic font fantastic reason we have downloaded it let's install it but we can't see this font inside our this text menu there are cg times there are symbol universe ots but not the fonts that are in the windows or uh, so what you can do to add these all fonts is that uh, you have to go to the file and from the file go to options in the options select configuration editor and then click font here type pro dash font and type and this pro font directory will appear click add change and now it will be added to uh, uh, the other options that are inside this box click close now pro font directory it basically contains the directory of the fonts that you used here so what we have to do is that we have to change this directory to the windows directory it contains all the fonts so if you are using windows 7 8 or 10 you can change this directory click here and this from this drop down menu click browse go to C C directory or the directory that has your windows installed from here go to windows and then fonts so C windows fonts and click OK so now your directory is set click OK it will ask you if you want to have these changes permanent click yes and it will ask for config file just uh, uh, overwrite the file ok and now you have made these changes now after doing this you have to close uh, your program open it again opening it let's create this font again go to text 
lands. Now you can see there are lots and lots of fonts here. All of the fonts that were in the windows. So font which we had uh, uh, downloaded its, its name was Fantastic Reason. So let's see. A fantastic reason personal use and now click type A B C D in this way you can add any font in Creo hope you enjoyed the video don't forget to subscribe